<clears throat> wow. Okay. Hey everyone, it's me here today with another video. As you can see, this is a really chill video. And it's also kind of dark in here, and I don't know why. But, this is going to be the first video in the wintry slash Christmassy spirit of things. I know you're kind of thrown off because I'm wearing a minute shirt, but anyway. Video is going to be 10 things that a lot of people are going to be asking for for Christmas. So these are Christmas list ideas. Um, there may be a little bit of some sub items in here, so um, I suggest sticking around. Some of these are on my list, and quite a bit of these are not. So, they know. Um, the first one we have is a record player or record. Or record player. I know a lot of people were asking for those, and a lot of people who have those are probably going to be asking for records because they are more of the expensive side of things. Um, we can get records in a lot of colors, and are we cheap on Amazon for well, cheap for what they are? Um, some great ideas you can get pop ones, Christmas records, like. Next one we have is a Polaroid camera or Polaroid items. I still know a lot of people who are asking for those. I got mine two or three years ago. Or like one or two. I don't really know. I don't remember. But I love it to death. I use it pretty much all the time. But I ran out of film a couple of months ago. I do not have film to take pictures, so film was a great thing to ask for, photo books are a great thing to ask for. If you go to my Polaroid video, in the description of that video, I have a link to a kind of gift set box. And that's a really good thing to ask for because it comes with a case, a book, and just like a whole bunch of things. So, you can get one of those. This one's another really big one. Um, if you cannot foretold these first three are really big ones but a laptop i know especially in high school or high school or going to college or stuff like that a laptop is needed because you have like textbooks and essays and a bunch of that jazz and i feel like it's just easier because if you were going to use a school laptop but someone might get something on it but they didn't know it was someone else you could get blamed or you just don't want to break the school laptop See what I'm going with is like there's a bunch of like academic things for laptop, not only fun things. We have next shoes and clothes. I know a lot of people who ask for shoes over Christmas for the last like three or four years. I've asked for different types of boots. Um, that's a thing. Sneakers. Clothes are really good because why not? gift cards so for gift cards you can literally ask for anything i know a lot of people who only ask for gift cards because it's the most easiest thing to do you can get a gift card to michael's at the body works forever 21 google play or steam if you're like a scanner people barnes and noble if you're a reader um urban outfitters h&m bunch of places, Hot Topics are really big place I know people get gift cards from, Amazon, iTunes, restaurants, so really gift cards are a really good thing to ask for because, yeah, makeup or perfume, I know last year I asked for Clinique Happy perfume, such a good smell, um, and then my I got like a little gift set of a little thing with the perfume and the lotions, so that was cool. Um, you can ask for like gift sets, of course, makeup, like I also asked for a lipstick last year, like blushes, blushes, eyeshadow palettes, things like that. I know people ask for a lot. Um, one of the things, personally, I think is cool is makeup gift bags. I think those are so cool because you can get a bunch of products to try and like cute makeup bags so there's like a bonus in there. 
Um, we have phone cases or phone items for the next one. So phone chargers. I know that that's one of the best things to ask for because then you can ask for a very long one. You can also ask for phone cases, like I said. Um, phone accessories, like little things if you have an air jack. You find a dust plug, styluses, screen protector. Again, most of you who are asking for those. So phone accessories are really cool things to ask for. Cute things. No, let me clarify. Cute things as things that can remind you of your child of your childhood or cute things to go for like stockings and stuff. So cute things could be like lip smackers or chapsticks. At least a lip smackers because that's one of the closest things I could think of for chapsticks. Um little things of perfume. I can't think of it, but cute things, jewelry, that's what it was. So, cute things is a great thing to ask for because the list goes on. We have next food. Everyone that I know asks for food, especially me and my cousin. Basically, my whole family asks for food. I ask for my favorite. So, I ask for spicy Doritos, Arizona teas, um, Hershey peppermint kisses, chocolate, yum. Yum. Uh, I know my cousin, she gets like sausage things. I don't know what they're called, but she gets those. Um, I know some people in my family who like to get like cheese. So, I don't know. Or like tester things where you get like certain popcorn things you test it or things with chocolate. Like that hot cocoa I know is a lot of things people ask for, so you can never go off really wrong with food and drinks because then you can just get all of like food that you enjoy. Um and the last thing on here is room decor. Some of the sub things you can go in there is fairy lights. I know a lot of people are asking for fairy lights. I'm one of those. Um dream catches, calendars, clocks, posters and poster frames, art. All decals, there's part of mine over here. And then you have stuff like lamps. I know my cousin, she's getting her room redone, so she's literally asking for a bunch of room decor, like a bed frame and a dresser. I know it's weird, but if you think about it in the long run, it's not such a bad idea. Blankets fall into that category, decorative pillows. Uh, a clock. Oh, I have a clock in my room. Like an actual clock. And an alarm clock. We also have calendars. I don't think I said that one, but if I did, there you go. Have it again. Just a bunch of cute stuff like that. Or like even trays. I have like a little Eiffel Tower tray. And I just use it to like organize and stuff. So the list goes on. <clears throat> and a little bonus one I want to add in there. It's just for my fellow pet owners. If you do not know, I have a guinea pig. So any background noise you heard is her. There's her cage in the album. So if you have a pet, ask for pet things. Like snacks for your pet. Beds for your pet. Toys for your pet. Literally, my cousin is also asking for a bunch of guinea pig crap. I sort of am. I'm asking for some treats, a new hairbrush for her, and I'm also asking for a new bed for her. I mean, last year I asked for her cage and a bed, so, you know, it's not such a bad idea. Anyway, guys, I hope you did enjoy this video, and it possibly gave you some ideas, and if it didn't, I at least hope it was fun to listen to me ramble about these things. If you... 
feeling generous today hit that subscribe button and follow me in the weird crazy cringy journey of my life and if you have not already go check out my last two videos all my videos i don't know literally the cringe just gets worse and worse as you go down the list so yeah um, if you are on a computer, and if you go to my channel in the homepage, I recently updated it, so on the future channels, you should go check those out. I'm in every single one of those, except for Rongo Copyright Music, which is also who made the song play in the background. So I suggest you go check them out. More music. If you want to know this particular song, look in the description. I have the title of it so you can see it up.